All right, all right, all right. It's Kevin Garcia, a.k.a. the Puerto Rican Kid KG. This is Fight Hype. I've got Eddie Hearn with me. We're in Philly, Boots Bam. And I definitely have some questions for you around that. But, Eddie, I, I want to get to the topic of the hour, right? Mm -hmm. So, a little while ago, news broke that you would be interested in a 5v5. Mm -hmm. You laid out the cards, what it would be. And Oscar's responded since then. So, I just wanted to start there. Have you heard his response? Yes, I have. And I've replied to his response on Twitter. Absolutely no fucking problem. Roll them up, line them up, get them ready. They will get destroyed. As I said to his suggestions, number one, boots against Virgil Ortiz. Sold for that man. Number two, Shakur against Zapita. Agreed, sold for that man. Number three, Mungia against Pacheco. Now, Mungia left Golden Boy for top rank. But if they can bring him back for that fight, sold, agreed. Devin Haney against Oscar Duarte. I don't represent Devin Haney. I'm happy with a fight. If Devin's happy with that fight, agreed, sold. Jack Cattrall against the Barboza Ramirez winner, agreed, sold. It's really, really simple. Line them up. We will smack your behind. We will take Golden Boy to the cleaners. We will put them out of the game and it will be sweet, sweet, sweet. So his, his Excellency has obviously got the show with uh, Golden Boy next week. Let's make it happen. We're ready. This is music to our ears. This is what we've wanted for so long. And I've talked him into a position where he can't back out. So let's make it happen, baby. There you go. <laughs> Amazing. Eddie, one fight that I didn't hear you say sold on is Oscar versus Eddie. He invited you to that one too. Yeah, I mean, look, obviously I'm a lot younger than him a lot more handsome, um, I'm a lot bigger, but unfortunately I don't quite have the ability which he has, which is one of the greatest pound for pound fighters of our time. Listen, if His Excellency wants to write the check, I don't mind giving it a go. Oh! I'd rather, I'd rather battle it out with him at ringside watching our fighters, um, but yeah, thanks mate. But, but yeah, never say never, but I think the reality is that's probably one I can't win. You know, regardless of the outcome of that fight, you you know, obviously Listen, you're a businessman. You would take that on if the, if the check was right. Fight Oscar De La Hoya on a, fight, a six six v six. I don't, I don't think even His Excellency could afford it. <laughs> but there's always a number. <laughs> there's um, always a number. But jokes aside, you know, as much back and forth as there is between myself and Oscar, this is incredible for boxing. Trust me, we saw it with Queensbury against Matram. Unbelievable. And that card, Matram against Golden Boy, and I want to beat Oscar bad. He hates me, right? I don't really hate him, but I'd love to beat him. And that card would be so compelling, and the fights are so good for boxing. And I don't believe that he can deliver some of those fights. And maybe, I, I, you know, I've got to speak to Devin Haney. There's other fights that can be made. We'll sit down, we'll get in a room, we'll make it happen. It's brilliant for boxing. For sure, for sure. And I appreciate all your insight on it.